Are you ready? Three, two, one. Welcome back to the Zach and Buzz Review. Review. Three, Three, two, one. Gladiators. Yes, Glad fans, we're back after a week's postponement. I know it's crazy. And uh, yeah, we've had a bit of a shuffle round, so yeah. we're in a different position at last. Woohoo! And uh, I'd I'd like to bring up the fact that mm -hmm. Bradley Walsh, Bradders himself, oh actually God. loved, well, liked. I'm sure he loved it, but he liked. Our review yes. of Gladiators. So thank fantastic. you very much, Bradders. And funny enough, yep. we got a Bradders. Yeah, he can be our little little mascot. He's, he's our Bradders mascot. Yay! Uh, this brings up, before we do our review of this yep. week's final, semi-final, uh -huh. yep. before the final. Did you get that? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, uh, figures. 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 So we're getting towards the end now. Mm -hmm. We've just got the one big final to go. Yep. Do you think the Gladiators are going to get their own set of figures? I mean, obviously, Bradders has because he's been in Doctor Who. Uh-huh. But, but for the classic series, they did bring out a whole range of Gladiators figures. Like, yeah. Especially, I remember you I've showing me Wolf and you've yeah, got a few. Yeah, I've still got some knocking around. I you've got I've, Jet I used to, yeah, well, yeah. and Lightning. I used to, have, mm -hmm. used to have Wolf next to my computer. Exactly, yeah, um, that's it. And he's around somewhere. Mm -hmm. And I've got those through. 3D posters as well. Yeah. Uh, I think they were sent out by I mean, we've got the original Gladiators the board game, game over, over there. there. That's so That's cool. It. In our museum of Does classic toys. this <laughs> series have the potential to I have so. a whole line of merchandise? I hope so. I hope so too. Because we need a Barney to go with Bradders. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, on to this yes. week's semi-final before the final. Yes, okay. it's semi-finals It's the two. final semi-final before the final. Or there the second semi-final. Yeah, but it's the, still the final semi-final. Yes. There you go. <laughs> anyway, it was awesome. Yeah. We've waited a week. I know. And finally, we got it. Well, we waited more than a week because yeah. we missed a week. So two weeks. Two weeks. Ah, what do you do, BBC? Uh, anyway, so we got there and uh, we started off. We've got, uh, who we got? We, got we have Wesley and Chung. Chung. And we've got... Kerry and Mary, Mary Louise. Louise. That's it. And uh, first uh, event. event of the evening was Duel. Duel. With a big, <laughs> the big dueling two freeze Cotton buds, whatever you want to call them. Um, pugil sticks. Pugil sticks. Uh, so anyway, yeah, that went well. Uh, unfortunately, for, if I recall... Um, Wes. Wes. Wait. He lost it. He, well, there was a bit little controversy. In his Twenty-nine run. seconds yeah, so against Giant. He lost by a second, oh. but Giant went over. Now, when when Giant went over, I immediately said, "Oh, well, that's it." You know, they're going to judge that Giant touched his platform. Yeah. They did the the, the uh, review on it, and <laughs> I had to watch it myself a couple of times. We went back and watched it on iPlayer. Yeah. And it does look like Giant still. Has his balance. Yeah. That actually he's bending down to, and he's not off balance using the pugil stick to, 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 to regain to, it. To regain it. He's kind of gone over and it's pretty much, yeah. It, uh, the, the ref, ref it's said a tough that, call. The ref said that he'd actually kind of lo lost his grip on it. Um, I think it was a good call, mm -hmm. although initially I wasn't sure about it. Yeah. Uh, but even so, saying, Wes lost by one second, unfortunately, mm -hmm. poor guy. And then we had Chung, who, <laughs> who's who been all the way through the series, my favourite for the win. Yeah, yeah. So Chung went up there and literally got battered. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like a piece of fish on a Friday it's night. It's not his event, is it? <laughs> no. Um, he's, he's the whippet, he's the fast yeah, guy. that's why I put him down for the Eliminator. And then we had the ladies. Mm -hmm. Uh, and Kerry managed to stay up. Yeah, she did a good old battle against Mary, Fire. But, yeah, oh, yeah, fire. and it's like Fire, no jabbing, no yeah, oh, jabbing, yeah, no jabbing. That's right. And she didn't really. There was a couple of little all. punts in there. But they weren't like with any um, like. But let's face it, I think the, uh, through the whole series, mm -hmm. the refs done a great job. Yeah, you know, all the calls, the most part, all yeah. the calls been good. Mm -hmm. uh, and then obviously, then then we had Anne Marie, didn't we? No, we had Mary Louise. Mary Louise. Why did I say Anne Marie? I have no idea. <laughs> Mary Louise. Mary Louise. Then, unfortunately, she got yeah, she got walloped walloped off. by dynamite. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it was dynamite. Yeah. So that was that was duel. Mm -hmm. uh, and then when did we end up going? Was the it the wall. wall? Yeah, the wall. And we had another Chung and Nitro. <laughs> this would be the third time 
They faced each other. And I actually, I actually, and Chung got to the top, and I think Nitro actually, for such a bouncy, happy guy as you are, Nitro, you did seem a little bit narked that you'd missed him on this one. <laughs> on the third, third, third time. Uh, and then Wes, he, he got, was close. Wes, he was close, uh, Wes got uh, wrenched off the wall by, by steel. steel. Ah! That's it. Uh, so that was good. Uh, yep. Ladies went up there. We had another mm-hmm. shoe loss. Yeah, that was on Kerry. And. Uh, Marie Louise, she Mary Louise, Mary Louise, you know, me, me and names. Um, yes, who are you, by the way? Exactly, um, this is a who and what yeah, review, exactly. Um, but uh, they both got to the they top, they both got to so the top, got but obviously, five. Kerry got the 10 points. Oh, yeah, because we had the shoelaces, didn't we? Yeah, that's it. Was, it. It, was it, was like, <laughs> it was like a little fumble, you know, by the shoelaces, and she almost, almost yeah. got held back. That's what we were saying about the whole shoe thing that keeps yeah. on happening with the wall. I you re- think ankle boots, yeah, I really think they should change the footwear to a kind of like a it's a, yeah. Like um, a foot, uh, not football, a, a boxing boot, mm. almost. You know, something that yeah. just cannot slip off. I mean, to be honest, even rock climbing shoes, what, on the wall, specifically for the wall, would be good wall, because but... they're they're Velcro and they they are not going to come yeah, off. But I mean, if you wanted a set of shoes, yeah, you know, trainers that are going to get you through the whole tournament, mm-hmm. you can still have some trainers which lace up the ankle. Just they only need to go up the ankle a little bit to yeah. stop them from being pulled off your foot. Yeah, I suppose. Yeah. Anyway, that's something maybe they should start considering changing the footwear. Because it just seems to be like every time somebody's shoe gets. I, I think off. did somebody's shoe also come off on uh, the bridge? You know, the one where they the the the, the, the gladiators have to swing across. Oh, collision! Collision! I but think. that wasn't in this. That one. wasn't in this one. But I think a shoe came off on that at some point. Yeah, it did. It did. Um, so you know, I think with the shoes. Next series, guys, please look at Improve the shoes. shoes. <laughs> um, yeah, so that was the ball. And then we were on to Powerball, wasn't it? Nope. Nope. It was The Edge. Oh, yes, of course. Our favourite <laughs> new event. I love that event. It's I know. So cool. They always show that opening, don't they? With the, yeah. with the, they've got the dry ice smoke and it's very dramatic. Yeah, the, the aspect ratio changes. Yeah. <laughs> it becomes very dark and yeah, really cinematic. Uh, really cool. And then, uh, So there we had Wes against Legend. Mm-hmm. Uh, and Legend took him down. He Although did. He did, he did sco- get a few points. He did get, I think did it was eight, f- wasn't it? Or something like that. Yeah, something was, like that. It was a good, good score he got on there. And then Chung. Chung. This should have been like his... like. Really, one of his top scoring events, yeah, but unfortunately, he was up against Apollo. He was up he? against Apollo, and, and then uh, he got taken out uh, on his second crossing. Apollo uh, nailed him, so well done, Apollo, for mm-hmm. doing what you're meant to be doing, and that's, that's good. Come get some, yeah. Um, <laughs> and then with the ladies, yeah. uh, that was where I was kind of surprised because suddenly we had Sabre back, and mm. I could have sworn that because she hurt her hamstring in doing exactly the same event. Um, last time we saw her, didn't we? Mm-hmm. And I thought she came out of the series, yeah, because she'd injured her leg. But she was up there. Yay! Uh, so Sabre was up there. But unfortunately, she kind of met in a clash with, oh, with Kerry, Kerry. And oh, Kerry no. shunted her back and put her on. It was like, ooh, the slow motion. Ooh, it's like, Cats out, land it was on like, their feet, right? It was like out of the Matrix, you know? <laughs> it was like, a, it was one of those, oh, damn. Damn. Uh, and, uh, yeah. Uh, uh, and, um, Mary so, Louise. Yeah, yeah. So, no, no, it was Kerry that knocked her off. Yeah. Yeah, I was just going to say okay, okay. that when she got off the net, mm-hmm. uh, Brad has asked, it was either Brad or, or Barney asked, you know, what she felt, and it was like, mm-hmm. 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 <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> we, that was fine. We like Sabre, she's yeah. good fun. Then we had Mary Louise. There you go. I'll get it right there. Well the end. done. <laughs> well done. And, um, <laughs> you get two points for every time you say Mary Louise and, correctly. Yeah, okay, there you go. <laughs> Woohoo! Uh, and she was again like, whip it across there, wasn't she? Yeah. Uh, she was yeah. up against Diamond. Yeah, uh, yeah, but she did get taken off as well. She did. Yeah. So there you go. Yeah. So that was that one, and then we had Powerball. Then we had Powerball, and that's Ooh. when the big thing happened because super big thing because it was the men and Chung went <sighs> down heavy and hurt his knee, and my prediction for him to win the whole, whole competition of gladi- gladiators went out the out window. window completely. You uh, cannot predict what's going to happen on gladiators. Exactly, but I mean, he was right from the beginning. I said, "Oh, there goes the evil dead." <laughs> <laughs> Right go. from the beginning of the show, yep. Chung was my guy. Yeah. No more. Chungle speed. <laughs> Chungle speed. Uh, now, thankfully... Oh, did you love his leg brace? <laughs> they gave him Mad a, Max style. They gave him a super, super bionic leg I brace. I wore a leg brace like <laughs> yeah, that. Yeah, just to have a leg brace like that, even without an injury. <laughs> but it was just such a cool leg brace. Um, and 
was I mean they held they held out and then they switched to the ladies and the ladies I think didn't they score equal on that one I can't remember uh, uh, I've got the score yeah it was like four 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 um, uh, and that was kind of just straightforward yeah with mm-hmm. with um, uh, Fury doing the the mullery mm-hmm. uh, but then we had the substitution for the men yes and that's when we had Matt come in who was against Chung in the heats and this is where I still find it a bit odd because <laughs> yeah I. Have nothing against Wes. You know, mm-hmm. Wesley seems to be a really nice chap. Mm-hmm. He's obviously he does uh, outside of his normal job. He does wrestling. He's a great bloke and everything, and he's in it and he's a contender. He has charm. He has charm, and, that, and that's fantastic. But I still don't know why he's in the show because when he was brought in as a replacement, he was out of nowhere. He never competed in the heats. In, in the heats to lose a heat to be a runner-up. He was just straight in the course. Just final. straight in. So. Uh, this is really odd because then they bring in Matt, and mm-hmm. Matt had he obviously was, was a pre contestant. Was in the heats, he, yeah. He was one of the contenders that was in the heats. Mm-hmm. So I've still got this kind of anomaly. And then in the previous semi finals, you had other people yeah. who had been runners up in, in other, heats. other things and things. Um, so w- this whole fact that Wesley's there. The Wesley conundrum. I don't know why he is there and again I, I can't I like him. I can't stress enough that I've got nothing against the guy I just don't know why he suddenly popped out from nowhere why a previous best timed contender took took that yeah. spot because basically now we're looking at a possible Wesley winning the whole thing mm-hmm. and he never actually had his own heat heat so anyway moving on so Matt came in yep. uh, took over he was doing it for Chung but unfortunately, he didn't score anything in Powerball. Yeah, he didn't score anything in Powerball. Uh, and then, the, what was the last event we had on that? Gauntlet. Oh, yeah, it was the Gauntlet, which everybody got full points on. Everyone got full points. The only kind of controversial thing on Gauntlet was the fact Again, that... Again, Matt, wasn't it? It was Matt that he said he deliberately left the... The course, the, the section. Yeah, but we watched that again, and he, it's he like, did. It looks like he got pushed out. He just twisted and went out. I don't, it was there was no premeditated. Oh, I'm going to jump out. Yeah, you know, it could have been like he got pushed out, and then he went over the mat to the finish. Yeah, uh, maybe that was what he was trying to get. At. Maybe, maybe it just didn't translate. But he still got reset and in the segment, yeah. And so all four of them got four points. Um, wasn't an outstanding. It's still not an outstanding event for me. No, you know they really need. To lengthen it, either either lengthen it by adding one more gladiator or lengthen the areas. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Give the gladiators a bit I more space. Um, I but, still think those two. Oh, the pads two boffers. Are... Yeah, but we've said this. Uh, Wolf used to use them really effectively. I think Rhino did as well. You know, mm. um, but at the moment the gladiators aren't performing brilliantly on, on Gauntlet, apart from that one thing with Bionic. <laughs> and uh, yeah. I think on this one it was. Um, Mary Louise? Correct. Yay! Two points. <laughs> Who actually, I think she performed the best out of the four because she did some really nice turns. Turns. She were like faint turn, faint turn, faint turn. She, yeah, so she, she did the best. She met the, the least resistance. Least resistance got through there and, and well done her. Mm-hmm. And then we were at the Eliminator. This is it. The, the last one. Who was going to be the last two to go in the so, final. So which which ones are we going to talk about? Are we going to talk about the men's or the, or the, or the women's? Let's do the men's because uh, that was the first one mm-hmm. uh, and the ladies was like heart stopping at, at certain points. So yeah. Let's do the men's. Okay, the men's. So, so after everything, it was, there was no point advantage. Yeah, it was 22-22. So they, so they've done everything they could and it was neck and neck. Yeah. And so they just had the one whistle, which was the first time in this series, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. First time in the series. Contenders, Girls, you, you will go, go on my phone. No, no it's just my whistle. On my whistle. On my whistle. On my whistle. Because there is no second whistle. There is no second whistle. There is just one whistle. whistle. <laughs> <laughs> you will go on my whistle. Yes. That's it. So anyway, <laughs> so, so off they went on, on the whistle. whistle. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, they were doing real, well. and, and in fact, a Matt got to the top of the cargo net. First, yeah, he did. He got to the he got to the zip line doing first. Doing it for Chung with yeah. ch- Chung speed. At uh, one point, it, it did look like it was going to be a Matt taking yeah. taking it. And then that just the whole thing with the eliminator, it proves you just make a mistake. Yeah. And that can and be then the, you pay for it. And <laughs> he came off at the balance bar. Yeah. Uh, and, and that's it, because he put his hands down so he had to yeah the jump off and reset and that was what lost it for him and so we have Wes in the final Yay! Yay! well done Wes 
and that was followed up by the ladies. And well, that was kind of that was there not... is absolutely no way that Kerry is not going to win this. Yeah, it was like there was a sir. nine second advantage. advantage. Kerry was at the bottom of the travelator, yeah. ready to go for it, and you could see in the background you still had Mary Louise. Not the two points. Yay! She was still at the top of the zip wire. In yeah. fact, for a moment, she was still at the top of the cargo net mm -hmm. because what happened was, as you probably have seen, if, if you haven't watched, if you haven't watched it, then thanks for watching the review first. <laughs> but but yeah, uh, uh, Kerry hit that uh, travelator, and her legs went. But the thing yeah. was, she she was going. If you if you rewatch it, she had a very strange kind of run halfway up. Her legs just kind of. What went to yeah. jelly, and yeah. she just face planted. Because she had two attempts. At yeah, it. both times her legs just went on without her. being like pressed by. Yeah, by Mary Louise. Another two points. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm, not... gonna, I'm in front of the door. And then the by that point, she'd obviously caught up and got to the travel travelator. Yeah. Or which point? So the second face face plant yep. brought her down and then that's mm. when Kerry mm. uh, uh, Mary Louise there took you go. over. <laughs> yeah, another two points. Mary Louise took her. I'm not gonna go that far. Overtook it. Oh, all right. <laughs> you be, said be Kerry like Mary Louise. Blah, blah, blah. Um, <laughs> that's anyway, count you. But that's when she overtook and she had the one chance that if she if she messed it up on that travelator, it could have been the could other have way. Been the other way. But as amazing that she managed to stick with it and, and get pull that, it back, pull yeah. it back. And uh, unfortunately for Kerry, you know, she went down twice, and that meant that Mary Louise went through the paper burst. And <laughs> there we have our finalists. Is that what it's called the paper burst? Well, it was in the original one through the paper burst. I mean, that makes sense. Because it's made yeah. of paper. No, it's a funny thing because I hadn't noticed it before until last night. I'm, I'm sure that in the original Gladiators, mm -hmm. it was literally just a piece of paper that they burst through. Huh. Funny enough, paper burst. Oh. But I, I kind of noticed last night that it's, it's pre-cut into segments, di di yeah, diagonal lines on it, so it sort of goes, it breaks into like triangles. Oh. So uh, I don't know if that's something different. <laughs> so <laughs> anyway, in the finals we have Wesley and Mary uh, Louise. Yes, from this week's show, and they'll be facing off against Finley. Yeah, and um, uh, the lady, the the, the firefighter, oh, Bro Bronte. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> well, anyway, okay. So I've had to change up my men, but Bronte for me for the ladies again. I said all the way through she was going to win. Mm -hmm. We'll find out next week. And I am going for Finley because Finley has been consistently good and fast on the Eliminator. True. So as long as he doesn't pick up an they're injury, quite, they're quite evenly matched, actually, Wesley and Finley. I reckon because they're quite, yeah. they're both quite big. They're big guys. But did you remember uh, Finley going up the cargo net on the last run he did? Yeah, he was like, it was bam, bam, beast. bam, bam, bam. Beast. He beasted it. Being in the army, he must be so used to doing uh, obstacle courses, mm -hmm. you know mm -hmm. that. Uh, my money's on Finley. Okay. But we shall see. We shall see. Otherwise, you're going to get Wesley. If he wins it, then he's a winner who never actually had his own heat. Which is a bit of an old one. You're never going to let that go, are you? I just I won't want to know. Maybe. Maybe viewers. If you know. Put me out of my misery. Please if you comment know conclusively below. why Wesley was put in the show. Yeah. Without actually having a heat himself. Mm -hmm. Let us know in the comments, please. Brilliant. So that was it. The last of the semi-finals. And we've got the final next week, which is going to be amazing. <laughs> but, but it means that that's going to be the end of the series. That's going to be our last video on Gladiators last until video. they do another season. You know, we've, we've got all the rest of our reviews oh. that we do. So, yeah, tune in for all the other reviews that we Please do. Please do, yeah. Um, because we've got new other shows coming up. And we've got all sorts of things coming so up. So much but let's, stuff. We, we can talk about that maybe the end of next week. Yes, exactly. Um, but uh, let's all get ready. One week to wait, and then it's the, the final, grand the final. grand final. Actually, and that's another thing in Gladiators. Mm -hmm. they don't they mention prize at all? That's a good point. They because haven't. in the old ones, when um, <laughs> Eunice Hut Hart, for example, I yeah. mean, you know Eunice. Yeah, yeah I, I know Eunice. I work with her. We've both worked with Eunice. Um, she uh, had the Jeep. Mm. You know, it was all about winning the Jeep. And uh, you always had this big prize, didn't you? Yeah, they, they, uh, they uh, unveil it or whatever. I mean, okay, you don't need a prize. Just to win the title 
is is fantastic enough. Oh, thank you so much. much. But um, yeah, but it's just interesting that they haven't had like a couple of couple of vehicles or something. Well, it'll be like a money prize. That seems to be a well, thing they go for nowadays. No, never but they haven't mentioned, mentioned it. They haven't mentioned it'll it. It'll be. A, let's hope the trophy is a nice trophy. Yeah. You know, but you don't need it. It's the accolade anyway. So anyway, that's it. That's the last semi-final. The last final semi-final before the final. Of Gladiators. Of Gladiators. 2024. <laughs> if you enjoyed this review, please like and subscribe to this channel and comment below any suggestions of further reviews you'd like to see. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one, Glad fans. <laughs>